the coffee. Essential to anyone in modern society. But do you know what goes into make this simple cup of coffee you purchase every single day? You probably don't, so I'm going to show you the steps of the manufacturing process involved in making your simple cup of coffee. It all comes from a paddock somewhere in the middle of tropical regions of the world, the drink you crave every morning. But after all this, after the processing gets put into bags, it ends up on the floor of a coffee roaster. It ends up here by a coffee broker, which is what the roaster goes to to purchase its coffee. So, after the coffee roaster has decided what coffee they want, they will come on pallets of 10 or so 70 kilo bags. After this, the types of coffee is sorted into blends. After the blends have been sorted, it'll be weighed and put into barrels. They're put into barrels to prepare it for roasting. So, after it's been weighed, it'll go into a roaster for an undisclosed amount of time. Then after the time has passed, the roaster checks that the beans are fully roasted. If the beans are ready, they dump the load of coffee into a cooling pan, where it is stirred around for a set amount of time. This is so the coffee is cool enough so it doesn't damage any machinery, and so it doesn't overcook because if it did this, the coffee would be bitter. The next stage is the coffee is sucked through a de-stoner. A de-stoner is so you don't get stones in your coffee grinder. So, here's some photos of the stones I've collected over the last six months. Yeah, there's a nail. Wouldn't want that in your coffee. So, the next stage of the coffee is it's put into another barrel. You will notice that the coffee is actually doubled in size from what it originally was. The reason for this is because coffee, when it's roasted, the bean bursts out, or the moisture comes out, and that makes the coffee bean explode. After this, the coffee will be vacuumed up into an automated packing machine. I remember when they used to do this by hand, and it took ages. If they shovel the coffee in, weigh it, take a bit out, put a little bit back in, it would take ages. So now, you just do this, and as you can see, it's all done automatically. It's brilliant. So after this, the coffee will be taken off a rotating belt, as you can see, and it will be put into boxes, taped up, and then shipped off to other cafes. But here at Mahalia Coffee, the cafe's out the front. So the coffee is literally taken off the production line, brought out the front, put in the grinder, run through the coffee machine, and served to the customer. You're a superhero. You're a superhero.